Hello everyone, I'm Jo Huey. I am a wellness specialist, uh, a speaker and a trainer. I'm also the daughter of an alcoholic and today I want to share with you a little bit about me, what I do, how I help people. Um, so my, the reason I got into this is uh, I had a conversation with a friend and she said to me, Jo, you've got a story to tell, you should tell it. And it kind of got me thinking and I spent some time with a coach and we talked about my story and, and kind of the, the work I may be able to do. And uh, I decided that I would help families of alcoholics uh, that are struggling to cope with their loved ones drinking. And at that time, it was all very new to me in terms of setting up a business and, and knowing which direction I was going in. So I, I sort of started doing that and I realised that I could draw on all of my own experience because my father was the drinker in my life and I grew up in a very strict um, household, a very unpredictable one with a father that was quite absent from my life and it was a very difficult environment to live in and I suppose knowing what it's like and how hard it is and then subsequently how it affected me as an adult was really the driver for why I do what I do now and I went through over 23 years of, of self-development which is ongoing to this day and I trained as a neuro-linguistic programming practitioner, I, I trained in Reiki, emotional freedom technique, all these different things to kind of make sure that I was in a position to help others, which was my intention. So I think a lot of people that have been in the same situation as me that have experienced um, trauma or difficulties in their life and then overcome some of those things, tend to want to help other people because we know what it's like and we don't want them to go through the same things as us or at least we want to be able to support them through and get them to where they want to be a little bit quicker than they might do alone. So I suppose that kind of really leads on to why I, I, I do what I do in terms of help families of alcoholics and I more recently specialise in daughters of alcoholics like myself. I've also um, had to experience my sister's drinking as well. She's now in recovery and doing really well. Uh, but that brought up a lot of things for me from the past, but I dealt with it very differently because I have different coping strategies now than I ever did before. And I think that when you're in a place which is, well, of despair, you feel like there's no hope that, you know, your life is doomed and, you know, you just feel like alone. And I, I know what that feels like. And I didn't want other people like me to think that their life, that they just had to exist and that was all their life was. I, want, I wanted to share all of the things that I'd learned with other people to say, I get it, I've been there, I know what it's like. And I know for me, if I speak to somebody that's been in the same situation, that empathy that you get is amazing. And, and you don't have to explain yourself because you know the person gets where you're coming from. So the reason that I'm doing what I'm doing is because I want to save people as much aggro and heartache and confusion and overwhelm as possible. Obviously that's part of life and we can't change that, but we can learn better ways to cope and to make that process and that journey a little bit smoother. And I suppose I would say that the reason I'm different from other people is because Obviously, I've lived through it myself and I know there's a lot of people like me, but I've also educated myself in alcohol misuse. I've trained and it's not often you get that blend of people that have been through um, an experience that have gone through a lot of self-development and are able to train and help other people. So I believe that combination is um, more unique. And also I do podcasts with my sister, which brings a really nice element because it can make people feel connected when they realise that there's two sisters that can overcome this situation and how differently we both experienced it. Um, <clears throat> my intention is always to do whatever the person that I work with wants. And I help people through one-to-one -one sessions. I have got a repair and reconnect six-week course, which is... Um, 
a very general course in that you can use my framework, my peace framework to apply to any challenge that you have. So I want to give people the very best chance, I suppose, in terms of getting to the root of their problem. I'm not interested in looking at the surface stuff because that's not where the problem lies. Um, and I can support people in the closed Facebook groups that come with my course, but also I run a Daughters of Alcoholics Facebook group and it's a really great safe space for those of you that are like me that have experienced someone's parents drinking and, and uh, don't want to feel alone anymore. So hopefully that's given you a little bit more information about me, why I do what I do and how important this is to me. We have to change judgments and perceptions about alcohol misuse. We have to raise awareness about how it impacts not just the drinker, but families and society as a whole. And that is my overall goal. And to make sure that people get the support that suits them, not that suits the system or government or ticking boxes. This is about providing support depending on what your needs are. And that's what I'm interested in. I'm interested in getting to the root cause, so that you can start to deal with it, but in a kind of comforted way, not in a scary way, uh, in a very supported way, because I know what it's like. So I hope that you will join my group, um, listen to my podcast. So take a look at my website, johuey.co.uk. That's J-O-H-U-E-Y.co.uk. Take care and I look forward to being in touch with you soon.